Good morning from the NASDAQ market site in Times Square. I'm Jane King for The Street, and today is Monday, June 22nd. Coming up today, existing home sales for May are reported. Gannett hosts a meeting with investors, and the U.S. Supreme Court could rule on same-sex marriage and Obamacare. Well, it is Judgment Day for Greece. Athens is pushing new proposals today aimed at breaking a five-month deadlock with its international creditors over a debt crisis that could see Greece dramatically crash out of the euro currency block. Now, few details were published available, but Greek Prime Minister Alexis Tsipras' office said over the weekend that he presented European leaders, including German Chancellor Merkel, with a proposal for a mutually beneficial agreement, which will provide a permanent solution. And Williams said over the weekend it had rejected a $48 billion takeover bid from an unnamed suitor. An energy transfer confirmed hours later that it had made the approach. Williams said the bid was too low. The move highlights what some analysts describe as likely consolidation in the energy sector, especially of moving oil and gas. And Apple taking swift action after artist Taylor Swift withheld her hit album 1989 from its new music streaming service. Swift said artists should be paid even during the time that Apple offered the free trial to customers. Apple caved and late Sunday said it would change its tune and pay the musicians during that free trial. That is a wrap for us. But be sure to track breaking news and analysis all day at thestreet.com. At the Nasdaq market site in Times Square, I'm Jane King for The Street. Have a great day.